slightly tighter shot, Tom? Okay. Oh, that's better. I think I need a little over here. That's good. Now, is everybody ready? Just a second. What happened? Uh, I think we blew a fuse. Ugh, I'll check the fuse box. It's in the basement somewhere. Persis? Are you okay? I'm fine. Oh, I think. Hmm, this gives me an idea for a segment. When it comes to navigating in the dark, humans fail miserably. But not all creatures are the same. What about cats, for instance? They seem to find their way around in the dark much better than we do. Have you ever wondered how cats manage to do this? Ow! Well, first of all, cats can't see in total darkness. They need at least a little bit of light. The trick is to make the best use of the light you have, something we're not very good at. Most of the light that enters the human eye is wasted. When light enters your eye, it strikes a layer of light-sensitive cells. But a lot of the light passes right through this layer and goes undetected in the back of the eye. That's why we have such a hard time in dim light. So how do cats get around this problem? Well, they have mirrors in the backs of their eyes. Mirrors? Any light that makes it past the light-sensitive layer strikes a mirror-like membrane. It's then reflected back and hits the light-sensitive layer for a second time. This increases the efficiency of the cat's eyes by 40%. And that glowing you see is the light reflecting off the mirror in its eyes. But the household cat isn't the only thing watching us stumble around in the dark. There are other creatures lurking about. You can't see them, but they can see you. Plenty of time. 
talk about allergies. I think it would be a great topic. Guys?